This segment is number 31. My discussion will be on the island formation or the birth of an island or how islands are formed. And you are watching my series of talks on planet Earth. In areas where the plates come together, sometimes volcanoes will form. Volcanoes can also form in the middle of the plate where magma rises upward until it erupts on the sea floor at what is called a hot spot. The Hawaiian Islands were formed by such a hot spot occurring in the middle of the Pacific Plate. An island is a body of land surrounded by water. Continents are also surrounded by water, but because they are so big, they are not considered islands. Australia, the smallest continent, is more than three times the size of Greenland, the largest island. There are countless islands in the ocean, lakes and rivers around the world. They vary greatly in size, climate and the kinds of organisms that inhabit them. There are six major kinds of islands. One continental island, number two tidal island, number three barrier islands, number four oceanic islands, number five coral islands, the last six is artificial islands. So I got a video animation on the uh, formation of island. Please. The formation of islands such as Hawaii occurs in areas where there are hot spots. Here magma rises from the earth's mantle and forms a volcanic island. Hot spots are stationary. When the oceanic plate with the new island drifts on, the next island is formed over the stationary hot spot, eventually forming a chain of islands. The farther away an island is from the hot spot, the lower its volcanic activity. 